the use of black and white for this was excellent because it gave it that classic quality um, of an old film set in history um, that also added that dramatic effect of the the lightness and the darkness, the the hope versus despair, um, and that it also made that twist at the end so much more satisfying where we're pushed right into the, the present, um, which is kind of jolting, kind of a shock, um, as it all starts to unveil itself and unravel, revealing um, the, the truth of his situation and uh, makes for a really nice contrast to the past classic quality to the present almost jarring future um, of the idea of retreating into memory and retreating to the past. Uh, I thought it was really well acted. I thought all of them were so ground, especially the family, the core family. Um, but yeah, really unexpected, surprising storytelling that was still grounded in heart and fear and um, some really honest emotions. I love the story and the time jumps. There were so many really wonderful parallels between past and present, and it was all executed very well. Um, just the way that he was told to breathe and the prompts before he went to sleep. I love that they applied it to both the past and the present. Um, we got some really wonderful acting, especially from the lead. And I especially love the photography. I thought it was just visually a very beautiful piece with such a compelling story. And this was so well done. A mom, dad, and son find themselves hiding from Nazis during World War II with very little to eat. The performances of the cast are excellent, especially the young boy who was so vulnerable and sweet. The staging of the apartment was convincingly rustic, as were the period costumes. I appreciated the camera work, especially the use of black and white oftentimes, which showed memory. The pace was excellent and the story really kept me in suspense as the family waits in secret. I love the tradition to hand the pendant from one generation to the next. I also thought the images of the old man and the young boy sitting in the meadow were so touching. I think what they did with um, the set design and the costuming was top notch. And they found some incredible, incredible actors. Everybody in this film, acting wise, did a great job. I loved the black and white on the cinematography. I thought that that was fantastic. They did this perfect balance between light and shadow. You knew what was going on. It was wonderfully done. And the story built this really cool mystery around it you know, that you wanted, it engaged you. You wanted to understand, you know, what the end of the mystery was, what's going to happen after these 15 days. So that was really cool. And then how everything went to color as all of a sudden at the end of the film, there was the twist that you find out what the mystery actually was. Very interesting, just representation of just showing generations and generational strife and, um, you know, going through different lifetimes and um, looking back at a life this way in a nonlinear way, you know, it makes you think about your own life, what you're going through right now. Um, so it was beautifully acted by everybody involved, especially the lead performers. We saw so much of the young boy and and the mother and the father, especially, and then the, the older man. Um, all of, everybody did a wonderful job. It was it was beautifully acted. Um, it, was, it was wonderfully edited, wonderfully directed, wonderfully written. Um, wonderfully shot, beautiful use of score. So everything about this was very nice and very, very well done. It was a fun twist. I'll say that. Um, very beautifully shot. You were able to build suspense um, that I didn't really, I wasn't expecting for this piece to be as suspenseful as it was. Um, but you, you did it in a way that came across very naturally. Um, and it was just a really really interesting piece to watch. Um, I definitely left uh, viewing it kind of blue, but kind of uh, kind of hopeful with that ending. It's, it's one of those happy, sad situations. The set design and costuming and that combined with kind of the black and white just really, it just felt very authentic for the time period that it was supposed to be in and the place. And I thought the actors did a really amazing job. And it was just so interesting to watch, especially after living through a pandemic and 
I just feel like it made the film so much more relevant. They used lovely cinematography and performances with beautiful monochromatic effects and violin music. It's just a very special food for thought on what's waiting for us out there after all is said and done. And they used very engaging characters, relatable scenarios, and it just beautifully lit. And I loved the high quality production. It was an excellent job. Mm -hmm. 